fighting a battle of a different kind. War veterans standing side by side, facing a barrage of accusations. Today, Basson's former commander painted a different picture of the man accused of misconduct. One of his comrades is seriously injured or wounded, and for that matter, one of the enemy is seriously wounded and enemy, and he should then, with his medical knowledge, try and save those two persons' lives. The Knobel says Project Coast was a credible program with no permanent harm. He says no international guidelines or conventions were violated. It's this testimony that's hampered proceedings. We will have to research uh, the evidence of General Knobel. We int intend to do that and we had indicated that we will not be in a position to cross-examine. The inquiry kicked off in 2007. Over the years, it was bogged down by legal battles. It resumed in earnest last year. The five-month-long tribunal that's become more like a drawn-out trial. Most of the witnesses who could have given clarity on this matter have passed on. And now, a six-month adjournment. By the time a ruling is passed, will it even matter? Gillian Pillay, SABC News, Pretoria.